Okay, well, we cleaned up the site. It's our last day, it's Sunday morning. Last night was a real cold morning, or night. I think it got down to probably mid-20s. So it's September 20th. It was cold. So we're all packed up. We police the area, make sure we take our garbage out of here. We don't leave a mess. We uh, just uh, drowned uh, the fire, so we don't start a forest fire. So if you ever come up uh, to the French Louis Trail, the Pillsbury lean-to, this campsite's just uh, down from it. It's right, I mean, the lean-to is right up here. Uh, but we didn't want to take it because we're all hammock guys. And uh, if somebody came in at night and they needed it, we left it for them. So beautiful spot, beautiful lake over here. It was a good good night but chilly so we're gonna get our stuff on and get back on the trail Johnny be out there <laughs> Looking into a National Geographic picture. Awesome. Okay. We just stopped for a couple minutes for Uh, we just stopped for a couple of minutes to have something to snack on. It's noon time. And uh, anyways, you know, I picked up my pack. And though I, it's lighter than what I started out with, it was felt kind of heavy. But, you know, this uh, Ohm 2.0, when you strap it down, you put it on your back, yeah, it's very comfortable. You don't really feel the weight when it's sitting on you really good so I'm, I'm really impressed with my ohm so nice backpack it's frameless so you're only going to carry 30 pounds not like some of the other backpacks that have a frame to it and you can ooh, ooh, and you can carry a ton of weight this one's lightweight I think it only weighs two pounds empty. So, anyways, we're gonna we're gonna put in some miles today. I think miles for me, six, seven, eight miles. To some hikers, that's nothing, but to me, that's quite a lot, especially the Adirondacks, like Rocky, and the backpack, <laughs> and the backpack is on my back. So. Uh, I think we're all having a good time. Oh yeah. We're all hydrated. Yes sir. And moving along.
The big old rock and river, right? All right, we're stopping for a water break. We're throwing Dylan's camera around to get some kind of effect out of his GoPro. It's uh, probably what look cool on his video. So make sure you check out Mountain Hammocker, his uh, YouTube channel. Uh, he's got a different perspective than I do on the trip, and which is good. So you got two videos to watch, mine and his. So, oh, still, what a beautiful, beautiful trail. It's just been a great day so far. Yeah, I'm looking forward to going home and taking a shower and seeing the wife though. But I'm still not done. Got a little bit more to go. Step over it. <laughs> Holy smoke, this one's even worse. I'm sorry, John. Did you get it? Yeah, go ahead. Supposed to know that Bryce is a farter? <laughs> no, he probably Buffalo. So a um, vehicle out here in the Adirondacks. <laughs> what those are wooden tires <laughs> or uh, wheels, wooden wheels. <laughs> Six and a half on the nose. That's an oil pan right there. How many? Six and a half. Yeah. Days gone by. Not good. Day one, two, and three up in the uh, left corner for you guys to check out if you want to. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching the video. Mountain Hammocker! <laughs> Alright, so we made it back to the vehicle. It was a excellent trip. The weather was perfect. It was cold up here. Uh, I guess summer's over. Um, you know, we uh, did a counterclockwise. We went up to, first went up to the dam, spent the night up there. There's a bunch of campsites up there. There's even one across the dam on the other side. And then we headed south on the NTP the second day. Uh, yeah, NPT trail. And uh, there's a few campsites, uh, primitive campsites on there. Plus the lean-tos are really nice. No, no bad lean-tos lead to was anywhere uh, and then uh, we couldn't find French Louis trail we know I, I kind of know where it was and I think we were right the only thing is we weren't going to bushwhack and climb those uh, rocks the kind of cliffs they were so I'm kind of disappointed we couldn't find that but uh, we all survived it was a good time uh, I, anybody ever wanted to do this loop you'll enjoy it it's it's up and down but it's not difficult so anyways thanks for uh watching the video and uh we'll see you next time all right johnny b outdoors all right thanks guys for watching see you around
Yeah, because you were looking pretty stupid. <laughs> <laughs>